Samhain, everyone. I thought I'd start off this video by showing you how I set up my altar this year. It's a little different than in previous years. Um, so I did, on this left side, I did it kind of dedicated to my ancestors, and the right side is a little bit more just Samhain. So in the back, um, left, I have my silver goddess candle, right, I have my gold god candle. And then over here, I've got a bunch of stuff related to my family and ancestors. I've got, this was my grandmother when she was younger. That's my grandfather and my sister's in, in his lap in that picture. But I kind of covered her up because she's not an ancestor. She's still alive. <laughs> but um, I don't have another picture of him really. And so then the one with the blue background is my great aunt. And then over here is my cat Callie who passed away last year that I really miss. And then back here I have my ancestor candle I made that I drew the little ruin on top of. I've got that, um, what do you call that? Cast iron skull. Then over here I've got my, um, it's a letter opener that belonged to my grandfather and it's got stamps in it in the handle. Then I've got this little toy car that was my grandmother's. This is a fake cat skull, it's not real. Um, it's like molded from a real one, but it, this one itself is not real, but it, um, just kind of represents all the cats that I've had in my life that have passed. And then I've got this, um, it's a rose quartz heart. There we go. That represents my, um, love and everything for my ancestors. And then that's a selenite heart. This is a little angel pendant that was given out at my grandmother's funeral. Then um, in the back there, my big working candle. Then kind of in the front here, I have a pentacle board that's um, shaped like a pumpkin. Move this so you can see the stem. Um, oh, and then I just have this little candle here for light. And this is my pendulum that I will use. It's clear quartz. And then, so then here I have my little cauldron, and I'm going to do a special little um, releasing ritual. So I've got a black candle for that, a white candle for that, the quartz um, for that. And then I'll be basically writing down some things I want to release on this paper and burning it in the cauldron. Um, so then kind of on the Samhain side, I've got um, some more rose quartz, another rose quartz heart. Um, back here is petrified wood. Reminds me of my grandfather, and so I just put it on this side to even it out more. And then um, I've got that little pumpkin um, light thing that you can put a tea light in. I've got a couple of little ceramic pumpkins. This is this really cool um, <clears throat> candle holder. Sorry, I'm my throat and allergies are killing me today. But this is this really cool candle holder that looks like a hand, like crawling like that. It's a little bit hard to see on the black, on the black. Um, black on black with this background and stuff, but it looks like a hand and it's really cool. I got it at a garage sale. And then I've just got my bell and my candle snuffer and my lighter. So I really like how it looks this year. And um, oh, and then of course I have my reversible altar cloth, the striped one, and then I put this spiderwebby type lace on top of it. 